الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله السلام عليكم جميعا ورحمة الله وبركاته Good evening I'm Dr. Muhammad from Arab Open University Inshallah will expose is it uh, my research already been uh, this research actually been uh, published uh, on Scopus on a reputed journal um, two, four, five or six months like this ago um, so Inshallah will expose this research. I'm sure Ruh Tiktor Sariya. What is it? Okay. Um, this paper actually uh, was uh, conducted about the impact of a training transfer theories on the contemporary HR practices, exploring the challenges faced by institution in the Kingdom of Bahrain. Uh, this paper actually has and take three main elements, which is Tamkin. I mean, uh, uh, Tamkin uh, vision 2023. Um, Bahrain training uh, centers and the HR. Why Temkin? Temkin um, uh, is launched in, 20, in 2006, and until this moment, no research uh, has been conducted uh, on Temkin uh, version, vision. Uh, actually, I don't know if you know that Tamkin is supporting more than 200 certificates uh, to Bahraini people. So I conducted three research. This is the third on Tamkin view. I took one of 200 professional certificate. Um, I want certificate, which is about the HR. Temkin supports um, two HR certificate, CIP level three, level five, and level seven. So HR is an essential element in any organization, which is to create a contemporary HR. You know, within a critical situation, HR are required to be highly professional, skillful, and so on. Um, to convey lots of obstacles and barriers, whether currently or in the foreseeable future. So the content uh, exposed is the ab abstract question of the research, literature review, transfer training, transfer of uh, motivation, training, transfer design, transfer climate, methodology, findings, discussion, research contribution, and finally the conclusion. The abstract actually is about Bahrain, uh, 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 Temkin uh, vision. So Bahrain launched vision 2023 and 2006 with the objective of boost the national economy. The vision was articulated to strategically boost the labor market and economic well-being through various projects that, inc that include vocational projects, training, interventions, and other uh, perspects, uh, perspects, which aims to transfer the economy from oil and develop further in all areas of the economy through skills, labor gener generation. HR, I usually describe HR as a heart of any organization without which the organization will not survive. HR is like a heart which is pumping life into all departments. Therefore, I usually yani, cover uh, the professional HR practices. This paper has been inspired from the vision, which is to investigate to what extent that trainers and HR 
practitioner or professional are qualified to implement the training transfer theories at the workplace in Bahrain, rather than to send the employees or to send the HR, okay? Let them be skillful at the training institutions, okay? And then they implemented at the environments of the organization, which is, which is yani, simulation to make the environment yani, like simulation, semi-environmental uh, workplace. Question of the research is to what extent do the training centers in Bahrain implement the training transfer theories on HR practitioner or professional trainees and what is needed in this regard? Moreover, are the HR practitioner efficient and qualified in transferring training at the workplace? Literature review. The literature covers many topics, which is any relevant topics, I mean, training, transfer, and its influential factors, theory of motivation, transfer, uh, training, transfer design, and transfer climate. Also, the literature, we can include it actually in the literature that implementing Halton's Factors here, and uh, I'm talking about the cutting edge or the gap. Implementing Halton's factors will positively influence the HR practitioner performance and enable him or her to transfer the learned knowledge, skills, and competencies to the organization. Transfer of training. The term Transfer of training is referred as the application of a training at the workplace. Concept resembles the experience of simulation at the workplace. Henceforth, the transfer of training can be seen as a healthy approach to boosting individuals and organization performance. Without the transfer of training, an organization cannot reap the fruit of the training program. Theory of transfer motivation, the transfer of training solely relies on the drive, passion, and eagerness, motivation, I mean, of the learners to transfer to the acquired knowledge to the bet betterment of the workplace. Thus, individuals should have the motivation to transfer their skills and knowledge to the job and ensure its effective implementation equally. HR practitioners should also showcase a strong desire to transfer and apply. The gained knowledge at the workplace for better organization functioning. Training transfer design refers to the degree to which training has designed and delivers to give the trainees the ability to transfer learning to the job and training should match job requirements. Therefore, HR practitioners should strive to design professional working model for training transfer in this regard. Transfer climate it is essential to see the type of transfer climate when it comes to training transfer. Training transfer climate refers to how conductive an organization climate is for transferring the knowledge, skills, and competencies gained from the training events. Every organization aspiring a healthy transfer of training should focus on delivering a healthy learning transfer climate. Hence, it is more probable that HR practitioner can transfer and implement the knowledge and skills to the work environment if all of the above training transfer aspects that HR practitioner learned through the training transfer are available 
and the working environment. Health on factors affecting transfer of training here in this is cited from health and factors affecting uh, transfer factors. Literature review. It is conducted that the ability to transfer a newly acquired skills and competencies to the workplace environment will help modern organization modern organization i mean the contemporary organization which is the current, uh, current situation perform better in the long run if the hr practitioner is fully equipped with all the training and transfer theory which is i just uh, expose it okay theories and the important element using Halton variables that affect transfer of training will therefore have a good impact on performance and make it possible for HR practitioner to transmit the knowledge, skills, and competencies they have learned to the organization. As a result, okay, HR performance will be of higher quality. Uh, qu quality eventually leading to better organizational results. Methodology, the qualitative method is considered as the research methodology based on the research aim, thus collecting data from the participant was as face-to-face -face interviews, I mean. Sampling, here in the sample, eight sample, HR practitioner, HR professional, trainer, male, female, findings. Actually, uh, four codes were stemmed from the research questions and the aim of the research. Here in the discussion. And finally, I came up with my own model, Muhammad Kashami Transfer Training Theories, as abbreviation MKTTT. Here in the model, which is to fill the gap, to transmit the environment of the institution or, or the organization with the HR as semi realistic uh, env environment uh, to learn. Uh, the employees in the organization. Research contribution, finally. Results show that Bahraini training centers are not providing or uh, instructing the HR practitioner or professional trainees of the latest technique of the training transfer that will enable them to transfer whatever being learned to the workplace. This means training centers failed of delivering new contemporary models and theories related to transfer training, transfer of motivation, training, transfer design, transfer design, and transfer of climate. Thus, the utilization of Halton HR professional to transfer learning and knowledge gained to the organization, which eventually organizational outcome. We conclude. HR practitioner should be highly skillful at technique of training transfer that learns about motivation transfer, training transfer, design, and climate transfers to be able to transferring it uh, to the workplace in a professional method, acquiring such important skills and competencies, while create a highly qualified HR practitioner and the professional able to meet the contemporary challenges of HRM in the 21st century. Thank you so much.